The drugs that we now consider antidepressants were discovered by accident. They were drugs that were used for the treatment of tuberculosis, and somebody noticed that some tubercular patients felt better when they took the uh, uh, drugs, and they said, oh, maybe this is an antidepressant. But they decided that without doing clinical trials that were placebo-controlled, and it turned out that placebos will do the exact same thing. One in 10 people get treated for depression with antidepressant drugs. The problem is only 10% of those people are getting a true drug benefit from taking those medications. The rest of them are experiencing a placebo effect and could experience the same benefit without the drug at all. The idea that depression might be caused by a chemical imbalance in the brain turns out to be a myth. We have drugs that can increase a particular chemical, decrease the same chemical, do nothing to that chemical, and all of these drugs work exactly the same. They have the exact same effect on depression. I assumed that the antidepressants worked. Everybody knew they worked. I didn't start doubting that until I was started looking at the placebo effect. And when I started looking at the research on antidepressants, I found out that yes, antidepressants work, but they work primarily because of the placebo effect, not because of the chemicals that are in the antidepressant drug. So the question is, if antidepressants are not much better than placebo, why are they used so much? Why do doctors prescribe it? And the answer is, the doctors had no way of knowing how small the difference was between drug and placebos because the drug companies hid the data. Almost half of the studies that were done by the drug companies have been buried. They have not been sent to journals for publication. What I hope the reader will take away from my book is the knowledge that there are alternatives to dependence on drugs to treat depression. Alternatives that don't carry the risks and the side effects that are produced by antidepressant drugs.